Hey to YouTube, what's it going? Um, this is the help you need with another 3ds Max video tutorial, and this is the continuation of the Cold 45. Uh, this video, we're going to do a little bit of cleanup, um, and we're also going to do some smoothing groups. Alright, uh, so the first thing we want to do is go ahead and select the handle, and then item select. Okay, uh, so now we have our handle here. And uh, I already put some smoothing groups on here, so what I'm going to do right away. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, disable all my smoothie groups, even though I did, I just kind of did a little bit uh, to see some things, but alright, let's go ahead, pick up all the smoothie groups, alright, now that i smooth, and now what we're also going to do is we're going to do a little bit of cleanup, uh, but yeah, what I mean by cleanup is, I mean, all these little edges and stuff that are everywhere, they just don't look good, we can go ahead and about. Um, okay, so the first thing we need to do is we need to just start deleting out uh, things here. So, all right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start deleting out some edges. This edge right here, just give backspace, and then once you delete the edge, you can go ahead and delete that vertice. Um, or vertex. Then we're going to keep this here for right now, but. We go ahead and connect that. Now delete out that. And we want to go ahead and Alt C, bring this across, and delete out this. Alright. Um, okay, the next thing we do is we're going to uh, Alt C, we should cut it, and we come all the way up from there to there. And we W and we delete that out. Um, although I think we might need that. Our vertex actually might need to be there. But we to make sure it's deleted out really quick. Oh, wrong vertex. Actually, wrong vertex, wrong line. Right. Okay, and then we're going to just pull this one all the way across. That, well, I guess cut it all the way across. Alright, uh, hope that's all cleaned up and looking nice. Uh, we'll go ahead and fix up those bits later. We're going to cover the back of the gun because I know right here it's a little messy as well. Um, so let's go ahead and delete out. Uh, well, we don't really need this right here, do we? So we're going to go ahead and select these. There's actually two of those there, uh, for me at least. And we're going to use like these as well. And it's all going to get a little bit better looking. Uh, we move this that way. Okay, all this stuff needs to stay where it is. For the most part, I don't think we can actually, I think we can get that. Yep, that can go. Uh, up here, uh, I like everything basically the way it is. And right here, don't really need this stuff. Uh, better symmetry modifier. Okay. That's just a check out what we do and don't need. Uh, we can go ahead and delete these. I'm not using these spaces. I'm uh, not using these. No back facing them. So, let's see that. And bless it and do something like this. Oops. Edge. Yeah. Okay. That'll just reduce your polygon count and make everything look a lot better. Okay, so now that we've done that, um, what we're going to do is we're going to do some smoothing now. And uh, we'll find that this looks a little bit messy right now. so. Uh, we can go ahead and select a few of these and hide it. So let's come to the front really quick. We're going to select all of these. And we're just going to come down here and just select hide. Uh, it's right down here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to be right view port so we can be that right. Oops. Left. Okay. And now we can go ahead and fix these up. Make sure they don't zigzag like this. Uh, let's pull this over. Pull 
this over. Just want this all to be in a straight line. It'll just help uh, make it look a little bit more uh, realistic, a little bit better. So, just up just a tiny bit. That's really all we need to grab as far as as far as this goes, so don't really worry about it too much. Okay. Uh, now we can go ahead and unhide all. Oops, so we unhid the vertices. Yeah, let's go in here and unhide all of them. Okay, back to the front view. And now we're just going to select all the places that we need to smooth. Um, basically, we're going to select everything that's uh, uh, chamfered here. So I'm going to select all this. Uh, we don't need that selected. So we're going to uh, select all the chamfered spots here. Um, uh, shoot. Make sure just to use your uh, uh, selection icon so we don't accidentally move things like I did earlier. Uh, we'll select all of this right here, and we'll go ahead and come down to the bottom holes, yeah, those things. and this can be the first smoothing group. Okay, next smoothing group, we go ahead and use all of this. This is just going to be the outside, and this is going to be the second smoothing group. Go into that. Now we'll keep it there. It's two. Uh, now what we're gonna do is we get the chamfered edges here. So all of these. And this will be three. It's three, and the last one that's inside here will be four. Oh, I do want to grab these two. So grab those, and this will be five, four, five. Five is ready in use. So oh, we select it. Uh, so it's three, but for some reason it's like that. Right. Now you'll notice uh, if I add three, which is this. It'll automatically make it look like they run together. Now, if I deselect it, that is really great. Uh, so, there are a few things that you want to do that with. Um, uh, this really isn't too much of it. Uh, we can go ahead and select all of these right here. And these extra polygons out here, we're going to make them run into. Uh, uh, these are going to be four and three. Just trying to get it so it looks really pretty nice. And we'll go ahead and select all of these. This will be five. And oops, yeah. we'll go ahead and select this. We'll put six down for that too. So this will be six. So that way this runs in with everything else. Um, okay, and we'll put this one at seven. This one didn't. So let's select this over. This will be eight. No, seven. Okay. Now we have everything uh, that we need selected. Oh, sorry, I decided for this right here. Uh, okay. Let's select one of those. All these. Alright, and this is going to be. Uh, Alright, and I guess that's it for selecting things. Alright, now um, that's it for this tutorial. The next tutorial, we're going to go ahead and uh, UVW map. So just do this throughout your whole gun. Um, 
the whole UEW map. I'll show you something that you're going to do with your smoothie groups. Uh, Alright, hope to see you guys in the next video. And uh, hopefully you guys learned something. If you did, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Alright.